975. It's in officially now for Merkel. Peyton Hinterberger now, the sophomore from Fairport, New York. was a state runner-up on the bars and third in the all-around at level 10 back in New York. This is one of the athletes Meredith Polisivic was talking about. Even though she's a sophomore, she didn't compete last year, so she has never competed in a college setting until now. That's a good point. That's her debut right here in Nice Pauly. straddle, Jaeger. Who had to the fight answer. through that. Picking the rhythm back up. A little shy of the cast handstand there. Ooh. All kinds of problems with her handstands. Looks like she missed her grip a little bit there. When you're doing a blindfold, it's what it's called, what she was in the middle of, you have to put pressure on the bar really hard on that right arm, and she did it. Her right arm was bent, so she didn't get enough pressure to move to the left side of her body. Well, she had to fight on her first handstand to keep it from going over, so then predictably was short the second time. And then in that transition, you mentioned it, you can see right as you talked about her right arm, I looked and, and she had a chicken wing going on, it was bent. Bars is a tricky event. Once you mess up the rhythm, it's really hard to get back on track. And oftentimes you see mistakes like those throughout the bar team. See if she picks it back up, tried it again and overshot that one just to be safe, but didn't have enough momentum. So she's just gonna walk away and, and disappointed look on her face now. Remember, six compete in collegiate gymnastics and only five score, so they can absorb that. And Meredith goes right over to talk to her and says, listen, it's all right. 